My friends, welcome back to Space Engineers. This is the road to space and this is episode number two. I'm Daily Fix and last time we built this contraption on uh, on my backhand. Um, I don't remember how I changed my camera. There you go. <laughs> Sometimes I do forget. So, I have been busy. I've been mining quite a bit uh, around here in the back. And you can see that this, this shaft's going down rather largely. Let's put on my light. And I've been crafting all the materials I needed to start work on this plateau. I even made sure that they were in my inventory for uh, for a change. And the reason for it is um, I was getting very high on the um, the total amount of inventory space there was. Also, there uh, this series has been. Um, has been recorded by halfway of August. Um, don't worry, this is just the, the second episode. I need something to do when I can't record anything else. And that being mining and planning out things in Space Engineers takes a long time. So don't be alone by anything. Uh, we are going to be having a wonderful series. At least I'm hoping that we're going to have a wonderful series. Where the hell is that contraption? There you go. So, I turned off my crosshair. Uh, the reason for it is also a bit about making screenshots, but it... I think it's annoying having the crosshair inside of your face all the time. But anyways, let's get work on, uh, on this wind turbine. Which we are at, going to be completing... I think about completing, I'm not sure if it is meant to be. So let's just do it like this. If we keep on having interior plating, then we will definitely uh, fill up the rest. Uh, but for now, I think it's the best thing that I can do. Apparently, I don't have everything on me. Hmm, that is rather alarming. Or do I? Oh, no, actually, there we go. Um, we're lacking a few things, like a computer by the looks of it. 80 parts. Man, I must have misread that. That's annoying. Oh boy. <laughs> we're going to be needing more computers. And that means I will uh, have to do a bit more of a mining. But let's start off by doing this basic refinery. And we might as well just go all way. As well as with the, um, the wind turbine. I really hope I'll get my second welder anytime soon. That would be a wonderful. So that has been done. Let's uh, finish this contraption over here. Uh, let's go down. So what is it that we can do with you? Do you have more? Oh, there's definitely a lot more. There's the metal grids. Uh, we need metal grids to create... Um, how do you call them? Mm. These things. Uh, not the survival kit. Not the HO generator. Where's the other thing? That's a battery. Oh my god, why can't I remember? Uh, control panel. Uh, cargo container. We need that to make a cargo container. But the one in this uh, ship is actually over there in that corner. So it is really tiny there. And we want to make a larger one. And that's why we would need the metal grids. Otherwise we are unable to make it. Uh, not quite sure with my placement how that is going to turn out. But I'm thinking about putting up a block on top of this. And removing this part over here and then put the... Uh, the storage container on this area. So I got my work cut out for me. There is uh, once again a lot of things for me to do. Let's see how far we can complete this. Uh, but we're already we're lacking steel plates, this place, and a good 30 computers. So that's a bit of a uh, misfortunate miscount on my part. I did construct the wrong materials apparently. Mm, that is a bit of a shame. That truly is a bit of a shame. So, I guess I'll see you once I'm done doing more mining. Awesome. 
Okay, so I did do a bit of mining, and by the looks of it, let's see, we need about, what is that? That's 50, 60, 70, 80, 32 computers, and we will need uh, at least uh, 12 steel plates, and for this place. So the displays have already been made, so let's take a quick look if we will have enough in terms of this. So we needed about 32 computers. And we needed um, 12 at the minimum. But we'll need a few more. Hopefully we'll have enough. Uh, but what we'll have we are able to do. I can't wait until this, uh, this absolutely is going to be... We'll have lights in here so we... I don't have to have that annoying light on every time. We can have the um, the base be powered by that uh, by the lights and that contraption on on there, which is a wind turbine. Because I keep forgetting the name. There's also a signal over there, and I kind of feel that I want to go there. Um, however, it is such a long way that I'm thinking about. Let's get. Where are you? My inventory, all of it, please. Um, we want to get this another hydrogen bottle with us. But we'll have to go to the HO generator, which is not over here. It's over here. So let's go. You get into my inventory. Now I'll have a additional thing to uh, power my HO. And, and this is going so much faster than just walking. Now we can actually fly all the way there. And most likely back at the same time. Hopefully we'll also discover some uh, some hostile targets. That would be brilliant. I would really enjoy that. Oh, there we go. I'm so glad that we took that extra tank. Otherwise it would have been such a long run. There we go. So what is in here? We have an armor slope. Parachute hatch. There is a button panel. Is there also a container? There's a small thing. Hmm. I would really like to grind this entire thing down because there are some amazing things that are here. Let's see what is if there's anything in it. Uh, this is just a parachute hatch, apparently. Um, we can't interact with it. There is something over here. There is a small cargo container. How do I access that? Let's just get rid of everything else. As well as the antenna. And the power. The, the battery. That's, that's cool. I could really use you. Can I now access the container? Man, having no, no crosshair is quite annoying. Uh, game. Show crosshair. Thank you. Let's go back. There you go. Wow, seriously. Wow, that, that's that's amazing. That really is amazing. However, this is all good loot. It saves me a lot of mining. Might have done so a lot uh, sooner. It would have been very nice, especially the cargo container. Let's pick up all of this. There we go. Great. I, I think that's a good haul. We got a lot of other stuff here. Small tubes, radio components. We got a, some scrap metal. Not quite sure what that will do though. But let's go. Let's go back to our respawn pod. Now because we have that ice lake nearby. I, I don't actually care that much about flying and using the second tank. I would actually prefer to have a few more in my inventory. Because I do have the tendency to forget. And once you forget, it will cost you your, your cost you your life in in this game because uh, you will die, <laughs> and that's not something that we like. So let's go. Oh, coming in too hot. There you go. Turn this one off. Let's see if we can actually get. Oh, we have enough steel plate. That's great. Uh, we need displays and computers still. So let's get the displays and the computers. We'll also get the steel plates. Let's get this one back in the HO generator. Now the reason I cannot go from over here into there is because 
these uh, conveyor belts apparently only let small items pass. Um, so apparently it's like ores and, and, and other stuff like ammunition. So let's get this one in here so it'd be filled up. There's actually no good reason to keep this around here other than using the, um, the survival kit over here to recharge your HO. Of H2. Saying HO. HO is air, right? Hmm, sometimes I do forget. So let's go and grind this poppy completely. And we'll be adding that, uh, that extra block. So we now have the basic assembler. Let's take a quick look what else it will do for us. So we can refine and we can not store yet. So the capacity is really low. Actually, the basic assembler is twice, twice what is in there. So that's really nice. I think let's um, get everything out of here. Everything there is, except for those two, because I, I'd, I'd rather keep them. Um, let's put in everything I will add I don't think I can change too much though what can I add all of that okay that's not so much uh, production tools oh we can make secondary tools that's great cobalt silicon nickel iron okay we will have to find silicon and cobalt so I have to go on a trip. We have magnesium over there, but that is no cobalt. Oh, look at that planet. Oh, that's gorgeous. That really is gorgeous. Wow. I, I, I really like that. So, we want to be changing this. For now, like that, like this. Uh, because I, I would like to grind this part away. And we're going to be placing the storage container over here and this way we'll, we won't lose anything also i would like to get a battery and that battery could go into this position once the where are you storage tank small cargo container no, medium cargo container would be preferred i, I guess let's go put you over there on, on five mm, large large is insane a lot of interior plating I think medium would be more than enough right now the small is just too small also let's take a look what we would need for a small battery we need some power cells computers construction components and steel plates let's put you on six as well as can we open up more of these blocks? So we did build the basic refinery and once we have built a light, we'll unlock even more. Let's take a quick look. Programmable blocks, LCD, text panels, timer blocks, console blocks. So many blocks that I just do not even know what the hell they're doing. But a small battery will probably unlock all of these options and uh, I'd say we're getting very close to oh look at this a toilet lockers that's great man the aesthetics I like that yield modules we need to make a landing gear but we have one we can actually just grind it down and repair it that's an option and we'll get enough of this unlock to start making our very first vehicle and i would really like to do that and get the gyroscope on there but also what i would really like to have on there is where are you let's see if i can find it it is the one that will detect all because i want to be driving around and finding all of the ore that we need without just having to um grind a tiny bit down this is not what I'm looking for where is it it's ore detector that's what I'm looking for the conveyor belts well we'll see maybe it's already here in blocks or detectors oh there, there it is or detector so that's the, a lot of future ideas 
Really like that. I should have turned that thing there on the top right off. But uh, let's see. This is going to be small battery. I don't want that. Like armor block medium cargo container. Can we just allow it to be placed over there? Why isn't this placing? This is so weird. What's going on? B. Free placement without aligning. Why can I not place it on there? Wow, it's been um, confusing again. Let me um, get back when I figure out what the F, F is going on. Now, I'm not sure what is going on completely, but when I switch to a small cargo container, it is working. And when I go to like 6, which is, um, where are you? A medium container, it just doesn't appear to be fitting anywhere. Which makes it very strange to me because I can actually connect this up to my ship. And it's just, it's confusing me. It really is confusing me. It's probably something I'm doing. Uh, but we'll start off with the, um, with the small cargo container. Right. Well, it needs to connect somewhere. That is a bit of my, uh, my issue. I don't think I can just place it down here and hope it will work what I might need to do is just place it in between these uh, machines but I'm thinking I'll make a lot more so I'm okay by making one over here we can always extend the base at the rear and then move our um, assembler a row backwards uh, this way we'll still have the, uh, the small cargo container and it will be connected to yet another one so that, there's a lot of things that we are going to be doing. So let us take a look. We need interior plates and metal grids, small metal tubes. So 15 interior plates, 20 small steel tubes and 4 metal grids. Can we interact with you like this? No, we have to be right over here. Production, so we'll do 20... We'll do a detector component. That is so nice. We need small tubes. And we need interior plating a bunch. And this thing is a lot faster. That is amazing actually. Wind turbine is producing a great amount of power. And I would really like to start also working on a battery. Which we would place over on this block. Let's get our jetpack on. Let's get rid of you. And let's go to G. Battery. And I want to have a small battery. And let's see if we can actually place this thing. Wow, that is really small. Hmm. Okay, I guess I'll have to figure out which battery I would need. Small cargo container, medium cargo container. Let's go to all blocks. Battery. Small battery. How do we unlock a better battery? Let's see, that's not it. If we make a small battery, it is not unlocking the larger batteries. That is quite something. I would have thought that, that it would. But who am I? Who am I to judge about that? Oxygen farm, HO, hydrogen, hydrogen. Small conveyor. Conveyor. Control panels, reactors. Where are my batteries? We need more batteries. Hydrogen tanks. Cargo air vent. Rotational. I would say it would be like on top of things, right? Maybe it is just this one. And it's just portraying like the um, the vehicle sized. Trump Trump Drive Spaceball. Man, that's some, some cool names. 
timer blocks not in here so okay so uh, apparently it's then let's place both of these in maybe there is a larger version so we have the uh, the battery and if we there is not a larger version oh, but you oh there we go that's the one that i want okay i was so confused there for a second uh, we're going to be placing you above there and let's see if everything is done where's the production tab let's get all of that what we need is ores is there anything in here so i would have to go mining i guess let's see if we can actually construct this thing where's the inventory it is over there let's take it like this let's see how far we can actually come So we don't have the metal grids and they are required. That's quite unfortunate. Can we de deconstruct stuff? Hmm, not really. We actually need some stone. Well, let's do it. We're going to be doing it together. Um, because after I construct the small cargo container actually there is a bit of stone we are going to end up the video and it will give me plenty of time to work on uh, filling up that cargo container with a lot of stone and making all of the materials that we are going to be needing oh i definitely need a different mine uh, but it will give us enough time to get the, uh, the stuff done for the entire base and start charging up the battery. I will also make the battery. Just so we can start charging up. As for now, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. I hope to see you next time. Don't forget to uh, leave a like, subscribe. Goodbye.